Okay, now I know what the problem was. All right, I'm fixed. Sorry about that. Today, for some reason, multi-stream does not want to work. But hey, at least something's working, all right? You don't get it at all. I don't know why this is back acting up. I've been here since 10, my time, for 17 minutes trying to get it to work. And it only just, good morning, it only just started to work now. And obviously, so I can't multi-stream this morning. I, I don't even know what's wrong with it. Greetings, cemeteries. Ollie. I don't know what's going on and why it's acting this way, but for now, it'll just be on Twitch and nowhere else this morning. I don't know if it was me or if it's um, just Twitch in general or OBS's multi-stream service or what. Sorry, I've been trying all morning. I, I swear, I've been trying for the last, well, all 17 minutes of since I should have been getting on. Uh, and it's just being... Ay. I don't like tech problems in the morning, right? Bad enough, like, when I'm awake, but when I am not awake, it is not fun. Not fun. Uh, let me fix all the things. Let me fix all the things. Thank you. Me too. I'm glad to see me too. Wait, what? <laughs> I kid, I kid. Oh, none of those counted. Okay, good. They didn't, it didn't actually play those. That's great. Okay, cool. So, to no one's complete surprise... I unfortunately was right about Black Friday and all they are giving away or selling is 1900 crown package for um, a stupid mount that isn't very interesting and a whole bunch of consumables which there is no chance in hell I would pay 1900 crowns for what they're what they're selling today it's a real joke Haha! <laughs> I am proud of you. Jackasses. Hello, Nywin. Jerk feets. I'm really annoyed with their with their behavior because we did ask some something of them and they're like, oh, but it's already being planned. Well, no one liked it last year. Yeah, that's fun. What made you think we wanted it again this year? Stupid. They so stupid. Big jerks. Uh, there is something wrong with MM. Not sure it matters to the rest of you. It's something that I rely on but the rest of you may not. Um, I found it, I discovered it this morning. Um, no, and not for 1900 crowns because you get all that crap with it, which some of it I would just delete. I wouldn't even want. Um, the new MM, the one by Charlotte Cran, I'm a huge fan of, and I think now, now, I wasn't at first, but it's definitely, uh, it. well, those are fine, except this new version of MM, uh, as as the old ones did, work really works really well with AGS, and I prefer the way that it works with AGS. The only thing that's really wrong with this version of a of um, MM right now is something that came up in the last iteration or two. I'm not really sure what was up with that, but um, it's. You know how you can blacklist people? Hey, Dan Lopkar. You know how you can bl blacklist people or blacklist, um... Hold on. Minion's being stupid. Come on, Minion. Don't crash on me. Don't crash on me! Okay. Change log. Visit website. I talked to Charlotte Cran about it, so he's aware. 
Uh, let me see what he answered, if he answered me this morning. Okay. Uh, I said to him, I've recently found that MM has about four... Oh, no, no, he said that. <laughs> Let me read what I wrote. I'm like, hi there. In the last build or two, I noticed the same people popping up that I previously blacklisted. It was one of my favorite features. I checked, and it seems to be blacklisting none of the people in my list. And he said... I recently found that MM has about four different ways to declare saved variables and access them. I have not altered that code. However, once I do, you will need to add the list, la la la, tell me how you're accessing it. I told him how I did it. And he said, I will look into it. Thanks for letting me know. So hopefully that will get fixed because I block a lot of people who, who jack with prices. And right now that's not working. So like, for example, apples. There's people in some of my guilds, and I'm ashamed to admit this about them because that they should be ashamed of themselves, that are selling apples for 250 gold a piece to the same people back and forth. Clearly, they're jacking with the prices. They were doing it with honey before. Now they're doing it with apples. Um, apples are not 250 gold a piece. Things like that. Uh, it's really frustrating, and I would really like them to stop, but... I don't, I, I have tried to complain about that in the past. It's like 50-50 whether or not the GM cares, you know, generally. It, sometimes they do, sometimes they don't. And, uh, yay, yes, I'm here now. Yeah, but I mean, even dumb things like, like food, you know. Yeah, it turns out the multi multi stream service is not working this morning. I don't know what's going on, but it is not working. So I turned it off and now this is working. And I'm irritated by it. I mean, it's something that like I can ignore it when I can turn them off, you know, when I can just blacklist them and they don't affect my prices. But the fact is right now they're affecting my prices and that annoys me to no end because they are jerk feats. Jerk feats. Let me just finish this and we'll go looking at stuff. Big stupid jerk feet. All right. We got. No, it's not yet. It will be Thursday. We are still Wednesday. You're a day early. All right. Let's go to War Child's Laughing Gnome Inn. And allow me to check to see if there's a backup copy. Get the little scissors out of the pencil cup. And a backup. Best person ever. There, there. There's potato husband ever. Back up. I keeps him. Oh, they said. I missed the word. Crap. Well, what's going on is there's some sort of error this morning where I wasn't even getting video. I had to uh, cancel out of uh, multi-stream. So usually I stream to Facebook, YouTube, and uh, Twitch all at the same time. I pay extra for that. And normally it works. But this morning, for whatever reason, as if I tried to stream to anything other than Twitch, it failed. I have a feeling the problem is with Twitch. 
Oh, I know, right? He's the best. He's so good. <laughs> good morning. No, he made my day. He makes my day. He's very kind to me. He plans ahead. Oh, good Lord. And even, even on bad days, I can still get jerks. Ban. Go away. All right. This is very interesting. Um, there's so many changes here. Uh, 599 out of 600 items. So guys, who, wait, who's along with no turkey? Who said that they're along with no turkey? Did I miss something? I got, I've, I've got my husband. He's, he's killing, he's got us a, he got us a baby itty bitty turkey thing. Oh, okay. And we have an Albertsons out by us and I think that's where he got it. It's just a big old like breast thing. <laughs> it's not an actual full turkey <coughs> because it's just two of us. See, I like ham. So that's a lovely stable. I like the fact that it has that, that piece in the front. So I don't know about you all, but I'm disappointed about the Frank Black Friday thing. Although I expected it, I'm annoyed with them for not playing ahead. Yeah, that's what we did because we're just two of us. Why, why get a whole thing and try to struggle with a whole bird, right? This is interesting. Is it just a, a, I wonder if it's a restaurant, the whole thing. Or marketplace. Excuse me. Oh, there's a bar. That's what that is. That's a bar. I've been um, thinking about something this morning. And I want to ask you your opinions, folks, and, and please feel free to, to all of you to weigh in. I was wondering, would you want to watch a streamer, what? Your cat said moo. Okay. Uh, <coughs> wow. Well, good luck on that, Azalea. I don't have that kind of bravery. Um, I give you credit for trying no matter what uh so would you want to watch a streamer when the stream said streamer <clears throat> is down like kind of depressed or would that bring you down to such a level that you would rather they skip that day right i'm not sure what to think they enclose this whole section here oh that's interesting Crystal Falls. Sorry I'm desynced. There's something up with Twitch today. That's true. You do. You're sweet like that. Wow, all these little new buildings. That's interesting. Sometimes just streaming at all is is good for me. Like if I am down, um, a lot of times just talking to you guys, not not necessarily you know complaining and talk about talking about what's wrong. Because sometimes there isn't even anything clearly wrong. Sometimes it's just you're just down, right? So I think in, it, just being around you guys sometimes is nice. Well, I know, I know plenty of people who do take that time off if they're down. I end up missing them. 
and and it's like okay if you're down you got to take care of yourself i agree with you but i do end up missing them you know i i just don't know what this is do you think this is like a whole restaurant complex because it seems like it to me i don't know war child Oh, thank you. Well, you guys do. You cheer me up every time. Even if I'm just, I don't know. Victorian Feast, Danny Elder. My, my friend, Danny Elder. She sent me a message saying that uh, I made her tear up with my grant build. Well, I cried like a baby with my <laughs> grant build. you I used to be this is a uh, Alan R. Cross, of course I used to be much more religious about watching J Hart but I have not been usually he's he starts streaming oh look at that cobble usually lately he starts streaming when I finish because I don't like you know streaming at the same time as him I like to look at those um Oh my god this whole room uh but you know he's he usually starts right when i end and so that's a little bit like i can't really all oh, these are such great ideas you know bathrooms are ripe for cobbles <gasps> that's gorgeous That's true. I should watch him on YouTube and, and catch his videos later because he, he streams when I'm too tired to stream. Good Lord, what is this? Is that a dumbwaiter? Hey, piano. I want to marry this room. Now those are effects on the bottom, but they're such realistic effects that in some ways you can't tell in the cups too. Beautiful. They just look so brassy and beautiful. This whole thing is just... Danielle Der is not only just the best at cobbling, she also uses... Um, a good amount of EHT to make things look different. I mean, look at this room. Isn't it stunning? She does both, and that pleases me greatly. Yes, Turkey Day Eve. Yeah. I do love this wallpaper myself. Oh, thank you. I try. I try to be I try to be positive. You know, I've been watching a lot of other streamers and I find that there's like that is a fascinating fireplace. Sometimes uh some people are better at being empathetic towards their audience than others. Um, some people just get embarrassed and don't like to talk. You should look at all of Danielle Elder's stuff if you like this. She has some really fantastic ideas and she does some amazing things. Her cobbles are incredible and she knows how to incorporate EHT really well. I mean, I'm, I'm taking photos of just, oh my God. Oh my God.
that is amazing. That's beautiful. Flat out beautiful. Oh, thank you. Oh, look at the table. Uh, well, those are made out of, um, you know, those May armor statues that you can get in uh, Khajiit starting area. Khajiit starting area. Um, Canarthi's Roost. <laughs> uh, if you do all the quests there, you can buy this. Wait, is this one Canarthi's Roost? I think it is. I'm not sure. <coughs> I can't remember. One of the starting areas. Oh, yeah, it's the dump. Yeah, this table is great usage because, you know, if you're digging up a lot of things, it's nice to use them in unexpected ways because they're essentially free building blocks. Yeah, I can't remember if it's Batnik or whatever. It's a starting area zone, though. Oh, Danielle there. God, I love your work. Look at that forest green wallpaper. Mm. Hello. Ula, 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 go look. Look at this, Ula. Yeah, exactly. It was Canarthi's Roost? Okay, thank you, MJ. I'm just showing that to Ula because it's... I think she'd appreciate it. Beautiful. She's so talented. Ah, this looks great. So, especially the knives and forks, because <clears throat> the ones we have aren't very visible. But you can do this. You can you can set your table, which I think really works for Thanksgiving type dealies. Uh, the frame is also effect. I don't think the painting is no. And what's nice about this is if you come into this house, right, and you don't have, oh, and you don't have EHT, what you'll see is this. Not bad at all, right? The walls look totally totally normal. You add the, the effects, it's just that much more beautiful. That's the way I like to use effects. It's like, you know, if I can, I would like it to not replace any. Oh, look at the like 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 napkins folded all nicely beautiful turkey dressing buttery whipped potatoes green beans and bacon yam souffle with nutmeg cream cream peas and carrots and lobster bisque She's amazing. Hey, Erna. I'm, I'm enjoying, uh, oh, this is beautiful. What table does she have sunken into this? She must have that moon table sunken into this. Right? Seriously. Doesn't this make you wanna almost tear up and cry? It's so good. Yeah, but there's something underneath it that you take a look. There's something weird combined with it. You see that edge? I don't think that's part of it, is it? Maybe it is. Statue based circular. All right, maybe. Beautiful. Beautiful, Danielle there. Danielle there? She would probably love love that. She's super nice. She's really, uh, oh, that's a great idea. She's super helpful. If you have questions, you can ask her. Um, <clears throat> she's just one of those giving people who is so talented, but yet also willing to give so much of her time and effort to help people. She's just a really good person. 
Look at the cornucopia. I keep finding details of things that I didn't notice. The second cornucopia. Beautiful. I want your house. Gives me your house. Yeah, like I said, super talented. Just a nice, nice person and talented. Okay, the rest is blocked off for obvious reasons. All right, let us go to favorites. I saved some that we can still go through. Let's go to Sirius's Hatfield, unless we went yesterday. I know, I know. I got to get on a lot of cobble trains, but... I just, I just haven't been doing anything, and I should keep finding reasons not to, but I shouldn't do that. All right, it's a 667 in this half held. This may be the one we saw the other day, but I can't remember entirely. If it is, we'll leave, but. Cool. I, I'm very <coughs> proud of you for doing that. That's a lot of work. And if you do upload it to YouTube, I haven't watched your video yet, but you know you can put music to it. They have some songs and stuff that you can use for free without copyright issues. No, this is different. It's more like a forest almost. Interesting, what's this? It's like a live fence. Doesn't it look like a live fence? Like the trees, maybe it's a, oh, derp. It's not a fence. It's a vineyard. If you upload it to, to YouTube, they let you edit from there, no matter what you use to make it with. Yeah, you're smarter than me, Arlani. I didn't figure it out at first. <clears throat> well, apparently you're all smarter than me because I didn't figure that out, and I think that's what it is. And here's the part two of the vineyard. <laughs> Yeah, just go to YouTube editor and give it a shot. I mean, of the editors out there, it's <coughs> easily one of the easiest to use. Let's see what's up in the tower. Nothing, nothing, honey. Oh, no, I was going to go wee, but I couldn't go wee because I didn't slide. Sadness. When you're a kid and you want to go wee. Well, uh, uh, I would guess that's a guard's house. Or a guard room. Not really house. <laughs> I'm tempted to to really get into doing more things, but I'm just <coughs> excuse me. I don't know why I have this cough. Um, I like to try things. I like to learn how to do things so that if you guys ask, I can show you. In fact, I may have you guys help me with something in a little bit to see if we can try out Cardi's newest addition to things. So we've got a crafting house, pretty clearly. And people live here. I think overall I would call this a crafting house. Just the whole thing I would call a crafting house. With like a, a feeling of Nord to it with the with the choices that they made 
All right, let's look at. Oh, yeah, yeah, please. Um, actually, let's go to EU and then <coughs> we'll come back here because there's some houses that I only want to show one of. But anyway, I can we can go test out that light on the light off thing with actions. I just need a second person to come when I'm not in the house to test it out. See if it works. So when we get to that point. Hey, Albert. Guiso. What's that? Thank you for following me on Facebook. You have the cutest little, like, icon. GlitchCon 2020. That's so cute. It's this cute little dinosaur or something. Uh, he can't. The ones that he has, uh, like lights on, lights off, are all things that you can do from the UI. Right? Um, pretty much that's the only way he could make them happen without the owner being there. But in general, uh, thank you. Uh, in general, it's it's not something. Really? Then you didn't get an eye. Why don't you contact them, Samo? Uh, so that's the problem, is that a lot of things can't be done. I'm actually shocked that he could do that. That he was even able to do the, the, the lights on or off kind of thing. I can guess how he did it, but I don't know for sure. Everybody's jealous of you, Albert. All right, see you later, Jemima. But yeah, everybody's jealous of you. <laughs> All right, let's start from the bottom. Wait, no, top. I think I started from the bottom yesterday. All right, we did an Aquarian, Antiquarian. So let's go to Gustel's Lesse Zimmer's Captain Margo's. I don't know what that means, but hopefully I'll figure it out. <clears throat> what is GlitchCon anyway? ESO at home stream? I don't even know what that is. <clears throat> Tells you how on, up, on top of things I've been. So this is Captain Margo's. 55 items. 56 items. Does not look like only 56 items. I would add a pot here, Gostel. <clears throat> Just so, like, one of the bigger... Uh, one of the bigger red, uh, red Guard pots or something. So that it looks like it's in a pot. But, huh, I didn't realize that. No, lovely cobble here. <clears throat> you can do this with any bed. Just put them on an angle like that and you made a couch. Very cozy little room. Libraries everywhere. Yeah, you just take two beds and you put them on an angle. And there you go, you got a couch. Um, and then over here, what's nice is, look what they did with the libraries. They sunk the libraries <laughs> into the wall so that you have like t curved libraries. Isn't that cool? Nicely done. <coughs> Excuse me. I don't know why I sneezed. Don't normally sneeze. Good job. All right. This is so out. House in Corber. Let me click through that to that uh, MJ so that I can keep it open in another window and look at it later. Hold on a second. And I shall read it. Tell me, I, I've been so bad. I just haven't, thank you. I just haven't been, <clears throat> I guess I said it already. I've been depressed. So my husband made um, one of the soups from it the other day. 
and it was delicious and it made me so sick because it was just so much meat. Um, Four hundred twenty-nine out of six hundred items. <clears throat> I would, if any of you ever make the the ribs, like the country soup in there. There's a country meat soup or something. Oh, that's gorgeous! Look, and they use the new flowers. What I tell you? What did I tell you? What a great usage. People are gonna. People are making good choices. Um. But if you do make it. Make sure you add more liquid because it essentially was just a meat bowl of, of shredded meat. It soaked up all of the liquid in there. It's gorgeous. This is gorgeous. I'm a fan. So. Oh, I'm sorry. <laughs> I'm sure they'll be all over the traders. People are probably trying to offload them already. Just check TTC. I'm sure they're up. People aren't stupid. They knew those were popular. Popular. But look at the table they made out of fabric and trees, I think. Yeah, out of clustered maple fabric and trees. That's pretty fascinating. Beautiful. And I used up so all of my cabbage flowers, plus I bought more. <laughs> <coughs> she cracks me up. I've never seen anyone use a fabric and tree like that. That's cool. Clever idea. Pretty lady tree. So yeah, when I say that I haven't been doing anything, it's mainly because I've been down. I've been depressed. So it's like hard to get myself motivated to build or anything. I'm just sort of like, blah. Blah. So these are like ruins. Oh no, why is there stuff floating? I'm assuming it's either magical or they haven't finished because that's not normal. Every, everything else seems <clears throat> to be, wait, I missed that whole section. What's the sparklies? Okay, I'm going back down because I missed the sparklies. Oh, those are those uh, achievement items, aren't they, from the new ones. It looks good behind Nocturnal. Hello, Olsen. Um, it is magical, yes. It doesn't look wrong, it's just, I'm not sure if it's supposed to be that the person is hovering. Because that could, that could be, uh, if it is, I would put like, you know, those floaty books, I would put floaty books next to it, or a candle to make it look like they intended to be floaty. What, GlitchCon? Good. Have a way or don't have a way? All right, up we go. Let's go to, wait, we did, it's, okay, Nywin. <clears throat> Nywin's got a bunch of small ones here, so let's go to their Golden Griffin. Do not have a way, okay, that sucks. <clears throat> you can't be the only one who has had that problem. I would Google uh, just seeing if someone else had that problem and if they posted how to get a hold of them. So now, as I've often pointed out, in fact, I think I point this out every time, <clears throat> this is one of the hardest houses to decorate because you only get 30 items. But what now, uh, unfortunately, Phaedra's lost again. <laughs> She can't find her way around the apartment. <laughs> See you later, Kit Kavesh. Uh, so we've got uh, an Alinor apartment done in Alinor style. So this is not 
this is like we saw yesterday and I went did their dark elf apartment. This is not as easy as you might think. There are things that go traditional is hard to keep up. <clears throat> and a pith helmet. She needs a pith helmet. It's hard to keep do a traditional house like this. Um, and paying attention to the details too, like the song of Pelinol and all of that. And the pretty kitty. Hello, pretty kitty. Meow. Um, the griffin painting, all that. I do respect people who are able to keep to the lore on this. And so I'm, I'm rather pleased. Sorry, somebody asked a question in guilt chat. I'm going to ignore it. Well, no, it wouldn't look right. <clears throat> I think you did a good job. All right, let's do two Hydries Dragon Cave. Cold Harbor. Cold Harbor, Cold Harbor. The hearts and souls of men. All right. My husband made <clears throat> made the uh, sweet rolls. Sure. With oh, Hunter's Glade, you said. Oh my goodness. Whoa, there's a Dargon. It's a Dargon. It's going to eat me. <laughs> I love Tydri stuff. In the teeths. And then this guy already got eated. But he's just standing there chilling. He looks really calm for somebody who got eated. Don't you think? Somebody's got a glowy tummy. I'd, I'd like to think that these are the uh, cilia <clears throat> that go down your esophagus and into your intestines, helping you move the food along. It's a crafting house, cute. And then I, I'm gonna pretend this is the rib cage because that's me being weird. Up we go. And we've got a feast. All right, now I'm confused. <laughs> this dragon has a has a kitchen. <laughs> I know, it's just a cave that looks like a dragon, but it's just funny to me because I was like all along with the illusion and now I'm like, <clears throat> you got it, congrats. You have the cute little d dino next to your name. Good job. I'm glad you managed it. <clears throat> oh, wow. What a shower. Fantastic, how creative. So that's the Sigic table, and that's a Dwarven fountain. Jeez, that's crazy. <clears throat> oh, look at that sink, too. Beautiful. I want to steal all your ideas. Oh, wow, an aquarium. <clears throat> wow, there's more. Definitely more KV than I gave it credit for. More KV, less uh, dragony. Dargon base.
You got it. Let me switch my filter. Let me switch my filter. Not doing the pie again today. We'll, we'll hold the pie off until tomorrow. The pie can, should not be overdone. Let me see. What have we, what can we do? No, you wait till tomorrow for the pie. You wait. I'll be a bear though. <clears throat> you don't want to ruin the pie by overusing it in a little den with the floaty, floaty books. This is lovely. It's an American money bear. <laughs> It's got a flag on the ears. I don't know. It was it was there. It was in the list. I just went with it. It gives me a cute face. Like a cute nose and everything. Wow, they even built the outside of the dragon, sort of. Like, those look like wings to me. So that whole thing is the neck, and this is a wing? That's insane. Oh, wowzers. Hmm crazy don't be sorry that's what they're there for is for fun and profit although I don't know how you'd profit eventually I'll come up with another idea on how to use them but so far I haven't I could tell bad jokes you could probably redeem it for one bad dad joke an hour or something like that another wing wow they spent a lot of money not money uh slots on the wings really kind of stunning he's got a very long neck all right <clears throat> let's go to one more and then we'll head back we'll go to chocoholics aquarium antiquarian Something like that. They're not cheap. Oh, piano, I almost forgot you. You're walking Spanish, right? Or which, which name are you? I forget. We'll go there next before I forget. Hunters. Ample Domus. I don't know if I did or not. What's she? Let's see. Lavathi Ample. Oh, lovely. I will be right back. I, I don't know. Too much coffee. Never too much coffee. Thanks for the bits. I'll be right back. little bits so I have the cookbook here and I think the cookbook has some things that I could make for Thanksgiving uh, side dishes <clears throat> they do have a yam recipe if I wanted to go with that um, so this is the thing my husband made I don't know if you guys can see this. Braised rib stew with farro. It was delicious, but it was like a bowl of meat. Hello, Dark Wolf. 
the, the recipe book, if you can get it, it is fun. Most recipes in it are just basically like, here's how you make baked potatoes, right? Like, as if we didn't know. Um, or they'll have like a lot of really simple stuff, like here's how you make mold cider or something. But they also have completely unique things <clears throat> that are very much just uh, Elder Scrollsy, right? Thanks again for the biddies. Um, definitely some things that are very, very, very. Hold on. Here's an example of what I'm talking about, and then we'll go back to looking at this. But on page 143, you remember these from Skyrim? The long taffy treats? This is clearly very, very ESO. This is not the kind of Elder Scrolls, rather. This is not the kind of thing that is... <clears throat> you know, like any recipe book would tell you, right? But then if you flip through a couple of pages more, you get spiced root cake. What is spiced root cake? It's carrot cake. I could have gotten that recipe from anyone. So about, it's about 50-50. Half of the recipes are decent, half the recipes are just, you could get them anywhere. It's, it's kind of lame. But you get the sweet roll recipe, which, I mean, worth the price of admission, in my opinion. So I would get it. Look at the way that that reflects on the table. 541 out of 600. I can never remember the maximum in this house. <clears throat> I don't know if you guys are interested in that at all, but... Spiced root cake, yeah. Seriously. Oh, really nice use of that uh, fake. This is actually an effect. Saves you a lot of money if you want to do these as opposed to uh, buying them. They even cast light on the ground, right? Close off. All right, let's go up. Oh, I like that the, check it out. Look how the tree surrounds the pole. It's all very s sinuously going over it. I, I do think they're missing a floor. Something got taken out here. I do appreciate though that they keep certain certain um certain things they try to keep lore like so when they tell you to make kwama eggs they say things like you can replace kwama eggs with three chicken eggs if you are unable to find any kwama eggs you know or the, for one of them they're like it's something with moon sugar in it and they're like if you're not a khajiit you may want to use regular sugar because <clears throat> otherwise it's very addictive. I'm like, it's addictive to Khajiit too, but we won't get into that. But they do keep up that pretense that it's actually, you know, you're really dealing with these ingredients. Good morning. Gobble, gobble, gobble. I can't do a gobble. My husband can. Let me see if I can get my husband to come upstairs and do a gobble. He's really good at it. In fact, he's so good that he's able to convince turkeys that he is a turkey. If you gobble at them, they come back and they uh, gobble back at you. You should, Samo. You'll love it. it. About half of it is worthwhile. Half of it isn't. Let me see if I can get him to do a turkey sound. Okay. 
He has been notified that he has to come up and do his turkey sound. Notification complete. All right. And a bedroom. <clears throat> I feel like this is under construction because there's one part that's... Oh, good! There's one part that's definitely missing. Um... That's interesting. There's like a part that's missing a floor, so I think it's under construction, but check it out. They've got petals. See the petals falling? They've got petals falling and snow falling. It's like it's still spring or something, but hasn't really gotten to the season where the snow is gone. That's actually a really good way of using those uh, wisteria. Sometimes those wisteria look terrible, but in front of the curtain they look really nice I think that <clears throat> Markarth uh, if you ever played Skyrim is going to give you some serious uh, nostalgia now that's wow that's bright and interesting I wonder what they're going for with that crafting room obviously There are a lot of really nice touches that they put in there that are so reminiscent of Skyrim that it really felt good to play again. Plus, I'll add this. The st Oh. Well, if you want to watch that instead, I'll understand. Um, I won't be offended. But the other thing is... Uh, what was I saying? The storyline for... Um, the new DLC is really long um, which is satisfying I mean it kept going on and on and I kept expecting it to end and it didn't it kept going um, and I was satisfied with the ending which I didn't think I would be because I don't know I just was I was satisfied with the ending I thought it was good Right? So, I'd say do the quest line. Wait, how do I get in? Oh, interesting. All right. In order, let's go to uh, Walking Spanish's. Wait, did I go see it? Yes. Very neat. Hunting. Hunters. Hunters, hunters, hunters. If I've seen it, it was ages ago. Yeah, nine months ago. I'm sure you've fixed it, changed it rather, since then. Yeah, that's the HT. It is indeed. Hold on, somebody wants in. like the other cat and she must have been nearby this is van gogh if you need to be seen in here it's okay you're allowed Ugh. what what well the door's open just open it i'm not gonna let you out you can do it yourself with your little paw decide which side of the room you want to be in He's actually small. He's, uh, when we got him, he was only about eight pounds. I think he's like nine or ten now. I know he's impossible, but what he really wants is to not deal with the other cat. She's probably stalking him. Can you really not figure out a door? It's open, you dummy. 
Oh my god, he's so stupid. <laughs> I'm just gonna let him wait. I'm gonna wait until he figures it out. Okay. Dummy. Dummy! Yeah, so my... For those who... She may be. She may be. So, my other cat passed away a few months ago. For anybody who missed it uh and this is van gogh who we had he's 15 he's an old dude we've had him the whole time we had grant my old cat well i got a new cat a couple months back and she's three and she terrorizes him because he she has so much energy and she wants to play with him and he does not want to play with her he wants to sleep and wow i kind of sort of just just remember this in a vague way what it used to look like this looks different obviously and so he doesn't you can leave oh my gosh should i open the door for him or should i just let him figure it out Yeah, it looks like a Bandari meat or a farmer's market. I love this. It's beautiful. But I do think I remember just vaguely what you had. And then you've got wine pressing. He's not the brightest bulb in the box. Um, Van Gogh, what are you doing? <sighs> Hold on. Are you stupid? Do you want in and out? Oh my God, you just sat there like a moron? That door was open the whole time. <laughs> he could have used a paw. He could have used his paw and opened it. He is the dumbest cat. <laughs> but I give him credit for not whining. He did not whine the entire time that he was waiting there. Oh, look at the beautiful flower cart. Oh, I love it. Well, you know, hey B, I like him a lot. Um he's the cuddly one out of the two but i get it you know she's she's young she wants to play with everything then we've got a painting room so it's like a craft fair? Did you say it was craft fair? Because it seems like a craft fair to me. I, I get a really strong craft. Ooh, look at that beauty. I love the window shutters. Mm. Oh, nice. Nice first impression on the house when you walk in. Beautiful. Ah, oh, I see what you did. You you know, I've seen a lot of people use these for windows. I don't think I've ever seen anyone do them up and down. <laughs> he established dominance with me, not with the little one. <laughs> the little one, he avoids and cries and does not like her. Those almost look like candy. Hi, Cassandra. How's it going? Been a while since I've seen you. Um, beautiful way you did the windows here. I'm a big fan. This looks lovely. 
Look at the way that, that this is incorporating a clockwork item with a normal standard item, right? Non-futuristic. It works. It's amazing to me how you can just sort of uh, combine some things and it doesn't look out of place. Oh, that's okay. You don't have to watch all the time. Um, it doesn't bother me. I understand. Also, good deal with the roof. Now, I don't know if you guys know this, but if you do the lean-to ceilings, you're going to have this empty space right here. There's different ways to fill it. And what Walking Spanish has done is planks, I think, or boards. May, those may be elsewhere boards. Yeah, those are elsewhere boards. So uh, that's one of the ways to hide that top triangle. So that looks really good. <clears throat> Lovely home. Huh? Yeah. Uh, the piano who has been drinking in our channel is the one who did it. They are very talented. And I went up on this side. I didn't go up on the other side. I can't believe you had enough items for the house when you did all of that, that fair in front of it or something. And then you have even more cars. It's amazing. And then the little fishing area. Sounds like he's bugging Mr. Potato now. Oh, the outhouse, how cute. There is nothing fun about my, my cat. <clears throat> my husband comes out and says, Karen, you may want to dump your drink in the sink. And I'm like, why? They say, like, because the cat was, the new cat was sitting on the oven where you left your drink and sticking her entire paw in it and drinking it. Yeah, I think I'll dump out that drink. <laughs> she is a, such a mischief maker. I do love it. It's beautiful. Uh, I think it, I'm stunned you had enough item slots for it. And it's gorgeous. Very nice job. Let us go to, real quick, actually, let me see when I saw, last saw your ample. Intruder! Eight months ago. What, sticking her paw in my drink and drinking? I thought she was just a little brat. I less so thought it was... Oh, thank you. It's beautiful. Anytime. Anytime I see that going on. You got it. Sandra. Solitude. Solitude retreat. Is that, is that still waters? Yeah, it's, that roof line is not easy. All right, so here we are in, oh my goodness. I do remember, was this a shrine before? I don't remember. Okay, you got it. Uh, you're in A, right? Cassandra, you're in one of my guilds, I think. Multiple, maybe. or at least were in one of my guilds. Can't remember if you still are. See, you just knew Lavafi was going to invest in those flowers. You just knew it when you saw them, right? <laughs> I know I did. They're very Lavafi flowers. Beautiful. This past weekend's flowers. It's so bright. This is your scary build. I can see that. I definitely can see that. Even though it's scary, you still have beautiful going on. <gasps> that almost looks like it's, they almost look like flies. That's creepy. That's not you, is it? 
That is, what's her name? And some Banekin. I like how you made that a heart. That gives me ideas. I think uh, we may have easier hearts to make around Valentine's Day. They are. Nothing in the egg. And here you are hiding. Hello. Ah, let me go first person. So this is ample domicile. And it's really like mostly a, a shrine to Azura, but also lots of evil, evil, or at least dead going on. Scary. I almost didn't notice them, but check out the, the gargoyles just subtly off into the distance, right? See, exactly, it's, it's easy to use. It does take a while though, you're right. Beautiful. Beautiful, but creepy. Did I miss anything? Because uh, I didn't get petals, so I'm not sure if I missed anything. Usually I do. What did I miss? What did I miss? Oh! Are those like flop? It's the ghost of the... Oh! Oh! Thank you for pointing that out. That's a lot less sad. Don't you see? You see? It's, it's sad, but it's less sad. Trying to see if I missed anything else. Oh, no. That is Lavathi's indicator that I have completed exploring her home. Yay! Petals. Petals. All right. Um, I'm going to head back over to Ine and so we can look at Cassandra's home. I understand if you want to go watch Bethesda, that is fine. I am not going to get offended. Um, I can probably cook better than them. <clears throat> Azura is a complicated god, Daedra. Because dawn and dusk is like birth and death, or close to death. Um, and she's she's not all one hundred percent good. What what would I be offended about? What? I don't know what I missed. Oh. I'm so confused. I'm not offended, but... Uh, I'm probably not going to watch them because I'm streaming. Yes. I did do that with uh, my ample as well. I call it my glow house. It's not very good. Waiting to load. Oh, gosh, Ifra, you're fine. 
you're fine. You can tease me all you want. I have a good, I, everything just rolls off my back for the most part. I'm just glad we're friends now. <laughs> we're cool. I'm pretty laid back. I would, but I, I don't want to do while I'm streaming. Maybe later. Besides, what am I going to get? An Ouroboros crate? Thank you for the follow, Sean Green. On Facebook, no less. I didn't even think I was streaming on Facebook right now. Apparently. I mean, based on Levathi's build. I mean, I can look it up, but we'll see. All right. Let's see if we've seen any Cassandras recently. Nope. All right. Oh, wait. What did I see? She wants me to go to Stillwaters. I have not seen your Stillwaters. Okay. <laughs> Come in and do it, you big baby. There's a turkey outside. There's a turkey outside. <laughs> <laughs> I wish I had that video of the, of the turkeys answering you. You don't? No, I don't know where it is. That is so funny. Oh, that is so funny. Um... <laughs> Yeah, it did just dox you. You've been told it's a very good t turkey gobble. Oh, good. And hee hee and a bunch of little laughy things. <laughs> LOL. <laughs> Sorry, Torber, I won't stalk you. Don't worry. That is a hilarious gobble gobble. Okay. You have been war you have been celebrated. Good time. Come on. Now can you see why I married him? Obvious reasons, right? He is my sense of humor. Or I have his, I can't figure it out. <laughs> turkey, your... turkey husbando is convincing. And then a what the fuck. <laughs> you should check your uh, uh, hangups. I'll take a look at it and see if I can get it tomorrow because that way on on okay. proper. Okay, uh, fair enough. It, you posted it on Facebook. Oh, dumb. Dumb of me. So the turkeys left. We will show you the turkeys answering my husband's. And then you heard the turkeys. <laughs> um, I'll show you the video of the turkeys answering my husband tomorrow on, on Thanksgiving proper. But I'm glad he made a special appearance. Oh, beautiful. Special turkey appearance for you. Oh, I see you. Hello. Hi. Wow, you got a weird set of glasses on. Wait, 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 don't, don't leave. I want to see your glasses. What? Oh, I see what you did. You have those glass, the thingies on, and then you have a different face mask. Okay, that's what that is. It looks like you have like a billion eyes for a second there. So we've got graded windows. Yes. And we got a doorbell. You come on in. And it's beautiful. You're right, it is very clean. Look, check out that chandelier. It's such an art piece. <laughs> I like how you hit a purple light in it so that it glowed purple. That's, that's cool. You just know though, you're gonna sit here, right? And then one day, <laughs> one day, <laughs> someone's gonna cut the rope. And you're gonna go, you're gonna go like that. <laughs> what? 
your rock lamp fell on me. I'm dead. Um, so these two, these couches are also what you were asking about, Torber, or somebody was asking about. They are uh, things on an angle, like beds on an angle. So, but in this case, they're the fur beds. So you make a nice little co comfy couch. Plus, with these little fur things thrown over it, <clears throat> they look like blankets. Isn't it lovely? Cassandra is a really great person too. Cassandra, don't you stream? I thought you streamed at some point. Oh, wow, you put the light in the middle. That looks really good. Uh, that is made of elsewhere platforms. Let me see if, um, if it's all that. Yeah, elsewhere platforms. Elsewhere platforms have really nice things going on. Maybe there's some solitude in there, but these walls are solitude for sure. The Art of Kwama Egg Cooking. In case you want to learn how to cook. Look at that. You hid that bowl of soup in there, so it looks like you're cooking the soup. That's very subtle. I like it. Oh, is this your oven? I almost bought one of these safes today. I saw them on somebody's. And I almost bought it. What are you using there for? The, is that a fireplace grates to be the handles? That is clever as hell. No wonder you ran out of slots. You have all these little clever Trixies. I'm jealous. I wish I could cobble. Right? Isn't that smart? I want to do something with these new chandeliers, but I don't know what to do with them yet. I haven't figured it out. <clears throat> they have promise. And then a rolling pin and cooking stuff. And, and this, for you folks out there who are curious, um, this is one of those animals turned upside down, I think. One of those frozen animals, the ice sculptures. So you can actually use that to be fake water. The windows. And uh, I would call this a sewing room. The Red Book of Riddles. There's some games. Maybe it's not just a sewing room. Maybe it's a den or something because it's got multiple purposes oh boots you put the boots by the door oh thank you for using boots as boots i love it because uh i did that and car and jay hart was just like really i those are so big though and i did it and i thought they looked great but and then you added the craglorn stuff Oh, my bad. Nice call. So we all learned something new, including me. But you that was actually not the animals. That was an elsewhere cerulean pot. Oh, wow. Look how nice that looks. Those are beautiful. Three floors, goodness. Oh, look, we've got a little patio. How did, do you guys believe that she kind of thinks this is bare? This is not bare. You did a fantastic job and it's really full. That's where spiders belong in cages, folks. Or eating mosquitoes, one or the other or both. Beautiful. And then what's over here? This is your library, obviously. <clears throat> Another patio. Oh, let me finish looking at this room and then we'll go up. Curve, little kitty on there. Bathroom, second bathroom. Yeah, I can see it now. 
Who is that? Debella is the toilet paper holder. I mean, that's okay. I'm okay with that. Prince Ernscar. You did. You saw a toilet and a toilet paper holder that was Debella. Oh, wow. So this is the rooftop telescope in case you want to come out here and it's clear night. <gasps> oh, wow. Oh, my gosh. That looks great. Apparently, we can do Debella like that. Debella can, can do that. <laughs> That's nice. And then what's over here? Oh, you can blow the dragon horn. Replica. It's a replica, right? It's not the real dragon horn. Oh, I'm sorry I missed those. Let me go out into your greenhouse over here. Who's running around back there? Why are there? What's go? Huh? That's not you. Sister Galena is insane. She's being chased by a demon cock. Yeah. Well, you can get the PVP horn. The PVP horn uh, is interactable. Is this your, this has to be an outhouse. <laughs> house this is a fishing house this is an ice fishing house look at the fishies underneath you see the fishies it's an ice fishing house what are they called tipsies or tipper tip tippers or something like that i should know this i should know this i live in tip ups tip ups that's what they're called the tip up Uh, I'm going to guess the demon cock because it's a demon. Oh, wow. <clears throat> what are you doing, Aralus? I can't. This is just amazing. You did a fantastic job. Thank you for inviting me. I really do like it a lot. I can't. I'm kind of astounded you made him a bedroom in here. I don't think I've ever seen anybody make this into a bedroom with a fire. Yes, it's amazing. Really? Seriously. <laughs> it's good. It's really good. I'm jealous, in fact. It's better than anything I've done. Let me check out your back patio and then we'll move on so that I don't keep bugging you, but... Anybody for some, it's a fish fry. Anybody for a fish fry? No. Yeah, sometimes that's what happens, you know? I appreciate it though. Well, their, their kitchens are super clean because they knew they were gonna be on TV. I'm sure their kitchens are not usually that super clean. But lovely job, and thank you for inviting me. I love it, and the, it looks fantastic. And sometimes it does take multiple times to get things right, you know? It just means you're, you care enough to try to make something look good. All right, let me see. I should probably go, but since so many of you are watching that other one, but hell with it. Uh, I want to show you, we'll go to Merc. Tag the Mites Grand Sigic. Exactly. I mean, doesn't everyone's? giving me a ticker tape parade with money. All right. 
Uh, there was something about this. Oh, this. These guns. I thought these guns were cool. I'm kind of like that, too. I'm a clean-as-you-go kind of gal. He can't stand it. He's just like, just sit down. No. I like... And then I'll put a spoon or something he's using and I thought he was done with, I'll put it in the, in the dishwasher and then he'll get all mad because he was like, I was using that! Sorry. <laughs> hey, you got nice cannons too, Delisha. Nice cannons. That's what she said. All right, I'm going to be a ghost. Yeah, they're easy enough to make. You should. You should use that. Wow, we get all... We have a whole dock over here. Something scary is going on. Sithis and... Not really sure what's going on here. I, I do, though. I always end up putting the stuff he's using into the dishwasher because I'm terrible like that. And then we have this. It's a nice little dock. Dock, dock, goose. Get it? No. Never mind. It'll come around again. They all do. They all come around again eventually. over there and then we've got a little crafting area no effects in here so this is all handmade what did you make down here You're kidding me. I do have them. But I don't have them on my EU character. I could get that there. Really? Free? I don't see it. Oh, yeah. I'll go back over and get them. One of you, exclamation point potato for PCNA, PCEU, uh, 50,000 gold giveaway every day. Thank you for letting me know, Everelia, and everyone else too. Um, if you have ESO Plus, go check it out if you don't have the Priestess and Mara robes. <clears throat> nice of them to give us something. But I would have preferred them putting houses on sale. Just saying. I don't know what statue those are. Imperial Statue Knight. I don't think those have been for sale yet. Those are crown, I think. Ah, I remember this now. Check out that aquarium. Isn't that beautiful? I think it's beautiful. It's like Neptune could be sitting here, right? Yes. <clears throat> Agreed. Trophy room. Yeah, I mean, if nothing else, put you get it for a month. Put everything in your inven in your bag. 
don't worry about it. You're cool. You're fine. I'm depressed myself, so don't don't feel uh, out of place on it. All right, we'll do one more, and we'll uh, in the meantime, I will pull the contest. No effects. That was just done with by hand. Uh, okay, contest. Pull the contest. Pull the contest. Pull the contest. Everelia! Yay, yay, yay! All right. Everelia Money's EU costume. Everelia won. Yes. Go away. Let me send you monies so I don't forget. And you can have a chair. Boom. Okay. So check this out. This is uh, Nord Barrel Mix 2014. Look at what they made at the front of their house. This is Mornoth. mid mid trap right so we've got those are um <clears throat> good those are um those those bosmer cups and they sunk those down and then put the poles in them and they look like a trap isn't that brilliant i think it's brilliant and then they have all of this this doesn't really lead anywhere but it does have an amazing path See, they made the path out of those trees. And if you look down, what they did is they took Daedric rock and they hid it underneath so it looks like it's just you'll fall into black nothingness, right? That's what that looks like. I think that's cool. It's a nice little trick that you can steal. And then they've got all of the sections. I actually really like that, holding the light. What? Those are those Nord things, Dragon Shrine Altars. So they stuck them entirely in the wall, just leaving out the little head and then hung something from it. That was an expensive set of lighting. Brilliant though. This is Mornoth, believe it or not. I do like all the statues combined with the braziers. I'm gonna get killed by the trap because I just ran right over it. Oh, it's just like a puzzle. This looks just like a Skyrim puzzle. Oh, wow, and here's the switch. Oh, wow, what a great way of, of closing it off too. Super impressed. Great job, Mix. Super, super impressed. All right. Do you want me to drop you guys off into Bethesda? Because I can. Although I'm not sure they deserve it. Jerks. We're the Draugr. You're the Draugr. Don't you get it? You're the Draugr. All right. I'm gonna call it. I'm gonna raid us into uh, Bethesda because everyone wants their drops. And here we go. Catch you all later.